Have you ever felt utterly and completely alone? Have you ever watched someone slowly fall into a deep depression? Because I have been there. I have felt the darkness choking the life out of me. Felt the aches and pains of realizing I was worth less than dirt. But the sad thing is, is I'm not the only one who has had these thoughts. According to childtrends.org, in 2017, 17% of teenagers had attempted or seriously considered suicide. That is a whole lot of kids. And they all viewed the darkness and what little hope that was left the same way I used to. A small speck of sand in a never-ending ocean. I want you to support To Write Love on Her Arms because their foundation is meant to help these people. To do that, you will need to know how To Write Love on Her Arms helps reach others, how people are helped through the website, and how you can financially support them. TWLOHA, or To Write Love on Her Arms, reaches people in a variety of ways. They are the top nonprofit organization on social media and have several celebrity supporters like Jared Padalecki and Miley Cyrus that help further their reach. They have a podcast as well as post weekly blogs on a number of topics, anywhere from anxiety to trauma, to help others realize that they are not alone and how to take steps toward a healthier version of themselves. They even host events such as Run For It, a 5K meant to help raise good mental health awareness. They have U Chapters, which is a network of student organizations on college and university campuses that exist to embody the mission and vision of TWLOHA. Once people become aware of the help that is offered to them, TWLOHA is able to assist them to find the help that they need. By using their Find Help tool, anyone can put in the form of help they are looking for, such as counseling or support groups, followed by their zip code. This will allow the tool to show them all of their available options near them which keeps these people motivated to continue searching for the help that they need. According to their website, the Find Help tool has seen 56,000 program searches since 2018. And for every four searches, someone will take the next step to sit with a counselor or call a crisis hotline. You can even help to write love on her arms by supporting them financially. Thanks to CharityNavigator.org, we know that 80.9% of their money goes to program expenses. So you can donate and help pay for the hundreds of events like Run For It that take place each year. By donating, you can also pay for someone to have their first session with a counselor. In doing so, taking that first big step in a positive, healthy direction. You could even become a fundraiser and join an already existing group or simply join up as an individual. If you also really wanted to help donate, you could purchase one of their really cool t-shirts. One of my favorite t-shirts is, on the title of it, it says, Forward is Forward, no matter the pace. They also sell that for the Run For It campaign. Any way you choose to give can be accessed through their website at twloha.com. Now that I've shared with you how To Write Love on Her Arms reaches others, how they help through the website, and how you can support them financially, I wanted to let you know that this process and this specific step in that process is very important. And it is very challenging for these people sometimes to even find the help that they're looking for. They feel like nothing. And the longer it takes them to find the help they need, the less likely they are to follow through in finding it. Jeremiah 29.11 says, For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. They are plans for good and not for disaster, to give you a future and a hope. Please, help us to reach these people and give them their hope back. Thank you. I would also like you to introduce you to my audience this evening. They are great.